Hello, 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 Capricorn, and welcome to your bonus. Thank you guys so much for tuning into my channel. Please keep in mind my readings are general and may or may not resonate, so take what does and leave the rest. Also, please be sure to check your sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs for more insight. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. If you guys would like to book a personal with me, ask me a question, or just check out my horoscope page, everything that you need will be down in the comment section listed below. So, Capricorn, let's see what messages we have for you guys today. Spirit, please tell me what messages you have for Capricorn. What messages do you have for Capricorn? Page of Pentacles. Okay. What is this offer here, Spirit? Ooh, it's a love offer to grow with somebody. Now, I feel like you have two offers, possibly. One could be from a Capricorn, Virgo, or Taurus, or a, a Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. But they both want you, okay? These can be new people. I feel like you're waiting to see which one mm, may particularly make you happy. But you're dating, all right? You're not going to put too much effort in. You're not going to be extra. You're going to just see, you know, who's going to hop in your pocket, basically. Seven of Cups. Exploring your options. Somebody here got options, all right? I like it. I like it a lot because Capricorn, you guys get in the energy a lot where you don't allow yourself to explore. You find something, you get fixated on it, you want this one thing. And then whatever else is there is just there. Not saying that you don't have other options because we all know Capricorns can fuck around. However, when you're set on something, nobody can move you off that. Are you guys a fixed sign or cardinal? I don't remember. Anyways, so, either way it goes, you might as well be a fixed sign because y'all damn sure set y'all sights on shit and that be it. And I feel like right now we're in the energy of am, 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 am. <laughs> All right, so let's just clarify. Even though we really don't need to, I just want to see, you know, what exactly is this seven of pentacles? Why are you waiting? What are you waiting for? Spirit, what is Capricorn waiting for here? Swore the rose. Clarity. I told you, you're waiting to see which one is the right one, okay? Yeah, karmic relationship. Because I feel like you've been through enough shit to know that motherfuckers don't reveal themselves right out of the blue with this mask card. So with this mirror, it's like, I want to see if, this mother if these people are really who they act like they are. You've dealt with a narcissist in the past who love-bombed you, so you're not going to let these people just love-bomb you and come up in your world and act like they're something that they're not, right? Okay. So let's just inquire about these two people, because clearly there's two. Okay, Spirit, so tell me. Tell me about this first person, this possible Capricorn, Virgo, or Taurus. Tell me how they may feel about my Capricorn. This person wants growth with you. Look at this. They're showing up as, as a, a page of cups now. This person wants you, but they are very aware that you have other options. And the second person uh, could be a Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. But let's see what this energy is exuding for you. The full, they want a new start with you. So this person could be somebody that was with you already. Um, look, and they're showing, and then now the, the other one is showing up at the bottom of the deck. They're, so both of these people are probably aware of each other, okay? If not, it seems to me like the energy of you being more focused on this Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio, who is somebody that you might have already been with. Because this person wants a new start. They want to move away to common waters with you. They want to have this brand new beginning. So that's speaking to me like you knew this person already. So it may be a new person and an old person, okay? Take it how it resonates. But let's see. Spirit, what is the outcome? What is the possible outcome for Capricorn? What is the possible outcome for Capricorn? What is the possible... Seven of Cups, still exploring your options, waiting to see what the fuck the best decision is and going with your intuition. I mean, ain't nothing wrong with that. You don't need to move fast. Y'all move slow any fucking way. Let's see. What is the advice? The Five of Swords. Don't let nobody fucking play with you, okay? Yeah. Anybody who seems like a player or somebody who's not really being genuine and honest with you, dead that shit immediately. 
Don't give it a chance to show any more than what it is. You've been there already. You know what the fuck it look like when it ain't right. All right? And don't let it be something that it ain't. Period. Let's get one card from the Love Oracle. One card from the Love Oracle for my beautiful Capricorn. And it says trust. This situation is calling for you to have faith. All right? Thank you.